Well, we all know the final exams are underway and learners have joined tutoring classes in search of assistance to better understand their learning material. Now in South Africa, many communities live in poverty and are unable to afford tutoring classes for their children. However, our Mandela Monday hero for this week is a man who believes in liberation through education and provides academic facilitation to the underprivileged communities in the Western Cape. I do believe that education can change the course of the lives of the kids which we're working with and that it can give them a better picture of what their lives could look like. Jeremy Smith is passionate about education and has worked in youth development for five years. At the Ikasi Youth After School Programme, he's an academic facilitator in English and Maths. The reason why I joined Ikasi Youth because when I read up on the organisation, I saw that they're working with young boys. They have an educational programme which I felt that I could contribute. I made the application and to work as the academic uh, program facilitator. If I look at my life and the, change, the changes that has happened in me, um, the sense of achievement, the, the sense of community, the change of uplifting others, then in that sense I'd like to encourage others to give back as well. And in that sense and in that way, I see myself just as one person making a difference. But if one person can make the difference and encourage another person to make a difference, then in that sense we can make a huge difference. Jeremy is part of a four-person team who work with 12 boys at a time, providing support in specific subjects and teaching them how to study effectively. Basically in our we are surrounded by Shippins, so now we tend to get little time to study because at night we get distracted by the music. So now here we have quiet space where we can be able to study. Before I joined Ikasi Youth, um, I used to be one of those naughty boys in school in 2013. But then I joined Ikasi in 2014, mm. of which um, eventually um, I changed my behavior. And as you speak now, I'm, I'm a head boy of the school. My marks have been increasing rapidly since I've joined the program. It was now there. Also taught me techniques on how to study. Jeremy is a cool guy. Um, he actually listens to us um, whenever like, we speak to him. And he's there for us academically. Because even like he's here to teach us um, English and math. And eventually my English marks have improved a lot. So yeah, I'm very grateful to you. It's believing in a culture of service that motivates Jeremy and the experience of helping the boys is as much an education for him as it is for them. I think I see the academic program is a facilitation program and supports what the boys are currently learning at school. Facilitation happens either with myself or one of our facilitators who run the academic sessions. The goal for ICASI is to become a training center where we can train more facilitators in more communities and in that way roll out our curriculum. This young man embodies what Nelson Mandela meant when he said education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world.